So if you have been losing weight since the past say 10 days, there's a huge weight loss, mm. then that is one very positive, uh, one sign where, you know, we can say that it's an insulin dependent diabetes. Your body is run out of it. Got it. Got it. But for older diabetes, mm. wherein, you know, there is, a, 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 you know, the, the lifestyle is such, you know, you you eat a lot of outside food, mm. you have a lot of stress. It is more of insulin resistance. Okay. So what is insulin resistance? Your insulin is very much there. Mm. In fact, if you check it in the pre-diabetic stage, it will be more. Okay. It's called hyperinsulinemia. Okay. So the more the insulin in the blood, mm. you will get to know that you are insulin resistant because insulin is there. Then what? Is, why is my glucose level high? Mm. Because there is a problem in the insulin receptors. Understood. There is something clogging in the keyhole of the insulin receptors. Mm. So the insulin is not able to open that lock, open that lock mm. and therefore glucose accumulates in the blood. It's so funny. So if I was to just visualize this in an insulin deficient state, the problem is with the key. Right. There's no key only. And right. in the insulin resistant state, to put it simply, right. the problem is with the lock. Absolutely. Where there's enough key circulating in the blood, but the locks aren't being opened. Right, right. This then right. also means that the way you would treat both of these exactly. would be very different. It will be very different. The symptoms will be very different. Mm. The tests that, you know, uh, uh, make us understand, they will be very different. Okay.